Hello everybody, how's it going? This is Nem and I welcome back to I think this is part 50 of my last play of Fire on the Sacred Stones. Last part, I think I got it wrong, and I said 48, per episode 48, it's episode 49. Whatever. But anyway, let's move on. Oh, that explains it. Okay, I was super confused why it still said it was part four oh yeah, like chapter 46 or something. <laughs> it's because like I wasn't saving it. Uh one. If I do this, save. There we go, okay, I'm <laughs> chapter 18, okay. Like, I was super confused for a second, like, what was that? Alright, uh, I need stuff. Don't I? Um, Johanna Hall, I should be able to see a dude here. Under shop. Alright, so... Hmm, what should I get? Akiel, you're fine. You need some bows, don't you? You don't sell bows, do you? You sell a lot of stuff. You sell elixir. That's a lot from the elixir, that's excessive. Alright, I'll just buy a couple of ulnaries then. God, um, say the. Hold on, I can sell that. Garrick Fimbulvetia. That kind of sounds like Norwegian or something. But uh, it seems out of place for this game. I also want to use that talisman. What does it do? I think it increases resistance. So, you think I'd give it to one of my tanks, but I think giving it to someone like Joshua would actually be really beneficial. Just because he is a melee, but he is very defensively weak. You have lances, you have everything. You could use an axe, but you're fine. Alright, so I think that's mostly fine. Let's sell some stuff first. Uh, hold on. Oh, oh. Let's sell. Alright. Um, that's awkward. Alright, I'm just, I'm leaving. This is, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> Let's just continue on. Alright, so I think it's part of chapter 18. So we're really close to finishing the game. The Groot sets off in search for Grotto's elusive Imperial Prince, Leon. Innes has ordered Frillian troops to aid in the hunt. The troops return with news that Leon has moved north. The group's search for Leon leads them to Mount Nelaris, deep within Darkling Woods. The scorching heat and sulfur stench render the area unfit for human habitation. The endless numbers of Gorgon eggs stud the forbidding landscape. Ooh. Two faces of evil. Evil. Ephraim, I must ask you to slow down. Okay, this is a cool pl part place. Wow. This way. Dragons. Uh oh, hi. <laughs> a bad feeling. Are those eggs? All right. So items. Let's do some item stuff first. Oh god, that's not what I wanted. Um, formation. That's what I wanted? Yeah, okay. Pick units. Oh my god, I keep... Can you please stop? Items? Okay. There we go, okay. I'm sorry, that was that was stupid. Okay, let's see if I can use Erika's thing here. Use... Okay, I can, cool. And now she won't be super useless. I know I should have waited till level 20, but... Oh gosh, she's so horrible. I need her to get that EXP boost, like, now. Uh, Great Lord. See, look at those experience. Or that stats. Look at that resistance! Did you see that? That's five. Holy crap. That's huge. Alright. Uh, what else do I have here? Dragonstone. Ah. I was gonna buy more. Okay. You? Let's use this. Yeah. Resistance increased. That means I think that's less magic damage, if I remember correctly. You need weapons though, so items, trade. Let's see here. Who has a nice sword they're not using? I think it was Erika. Let's see. I'll take this one. You can keep those. Okay. You could. You probably only use javelin. That's fine. Glyphnir. I don't really have. A, I do have a magic user. Let's see if. Where is he? Come on, man. There you are. Uh, that's not what I want to trade with. Okay, you have Glyphnir. Uh, no, I don't want to waste anything like that quite yet. I think we're fine for the most part. Alright, that's fine. Um, and I guess I'll save it. Sure. There we go, let's start. Are these eggs? 
Obviously, when they die, monsters will hatch. Hear that? Or, uh... They're timed. How do I, how do I find out? What's the button? Alright, whatever. I can check it out. Alright, it's this button. I can't... Oh, I, okay, I can. So, we got this guy. Level 17. Yeah, these guys are actually pretty good. So... Obviously, this seems way too easy. Demon Surge. Uh, who's the boss on this? Oh. You. You're just a monster. A Gorgon. I guess we're gonna have to tread lightly. Yeah, this is gonna be a huge ambush, so I'm gonna send... Can you fly around? You can, that's actually really helpful. So I'm gonna do that. I'll send you around. But I need Amelia to, to you know, vanguard this. And then I'll have defensive people on the outer edge, so they can't ambush me, or whatever they call that. I also need kind of more... Oh no, I... Oh no. Oh no, oh no, I know. I forgot to unpick some people. Okay. That's cute. You don't have any weapons, but that's fine. You'll stay with the group. Who else is with me that I don't want? Okay, I guess I just have everyone with me. That's okay. That's fine. I won't lose Mirror. Oh... They gain HP each turn. And th okay, then that happens. Alright. I gotcha. But only specific ones. Let's see. Wow, those are weird movements. Oh, okay, I see. Never mind, I'm stupid. What what can you do to this guy? Silver Lance does 20. You do 14 to me. What does Lance do? Uh, 24. Oh, that's range too. That can be problematic. Knees. Okay, so I thought, I thought this was like, like this path here was all I could go on. Okay. Um, let's move forward one. Oh, Erica has so much HP now. Jeez, how much does Ephraim have? He's forty-two. Okay. All right, so my formation's gonna be a little different now. That's fine. Uh, you. So I'm gonna attack this at a weird way, and I'll just keep Seth back, cause Seth, or Seth, okay. I'll wait until I can converge upon him right away. Yeah, I'm gonna have to deal with a lot of monsters here. Oof. Hopefully they aren't as strong as I think they are. Okay, so Ephraim. How much damage can you do to me? 15, which means 30, and this is gonna heal. What about you? What can you do to him? Or her? 16. That's not bad. What about you? What can you... Can you snipe him? Or her? 21. Let's change me again. 24. This is awkward. Here, I'll send Garrick in. Oh, I forgot to give him the legendary uh, weapon. Whatever you call it. It doesn't look like they're gonna be moving, so... I wonder if I can send her ahead? And, uh, snipe eggs. Oh, hold on, what's their movements? They can move. Oh my gosh. This is awkward. This is not gonna go well. Um... Should I just go in? It doesn't look like they can do much after they hatch. 20... Steel axe does 20 times 2. Should I just run in there for the axe? But this is... Alright, I'll just use this. Okay, good. A crit. That's awesome. Thank you. Because these guys actually do a lot of damage, but their hit chance is crap. Oh my god. Alright, so now I can kind of just converge upon them. Um, if I do this... Ugh. If I attack the egg, I can kill it, but then they get a kind of a jump on me, potentially, and I don't like that. I definitely need my healer for this one. That was very cool looking, actually. I like that. It looks like it should do a lot of damage, but it missed. So, I mean, this isn't as scary as I thought it was going to be because of that. Because their, their uh, attack chance, or hit chance, whatever you call it. That's fine. Um, I guess we'll just go up now. All we have to deal with are the eggs. I need to keep my range safe, of course. Keep my melee forward. I'll just move you forward a little bit. Healer. Yeah, keep you safe. Let's see, can they move? 
No, they can't. Okay, so after they... It's like they have summoning sickness. This is like Magic the Gathering. Cool. Just kidding. They don't. I lied. <laughs> that is definitely not summoning sickness. 40% chance and a hit. Alright. Alright, now they're starting to finally move. Shadow Shot? What? Okay, these guys... These guys need to go. They just need to go. No matter what. Um... So who's the one that hit him? Is it her? Holy crap. Uh, that's really not good. My movements are horrible. Ugh. My god. I'll just use you, Innies, to kill this one. And then I'll heal you up. Unless you miss, which please miss. Yes, thank you. I do have to heal up the other guy that I hit. Um, they don't have any crit, so that's always good. Alright, so that opened the way, so I have to move in this really awkward path. So I want a ranged person to... Um, I want to heal Ephraim, of course. I need to move a uh, ranged person. Item. Let's uh, equip you a sword for now. Uh, right. You. I want you to snipe out these eggs. That's not going to work very well, is it? I was going to heal you. Alright, whatever. Send Ephraim down a little bit just so I can heal him. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, this chapter is actually going to be pretty tough. I like that. Like, the last one was just too easy. It wasn't actually that much fun because of it. I'll keep you nearby. I don't want to get, like, flanked or anything. Uh, button. And item. You don't have any items. I'll keep you here. Keep you there. And I'll move you up just because you haven't actually been hit yet, so you're safe. Uh, what's your movements, bro? You cannot attack anyone I do not want you to attack, so that's good. I'm actually really afraid of the boss now. Because these things themselves are pretty good. But luckily, I can snipe off that one egg. So I'm going to try to send some guys off to snipe the eggs before they can actually do anything. Because if they all hatch, I'm in deep... See, that's exactly why I switched to the sword. I had a feeling that was going to happen. I'm learning. Can you two hit, though? Yes, you can. Thank you. It's very nice. I like it. I like how I actually thought ahead a bit more to get that done. Then we got these things. Oh, there it is. 19 damage. Are you going to kill... I can't really do much about this. There's literally nothing I can do. You missed. Okay, if you survive this, I'm going to have to rescue her. Um, okay, good. Holy crap. A frame. Hey, boy. You rescue. That was actually super lucky. Um, okay, so snipe this egg. Snipe. He has a lot of experience, too. I like that. It's like half a level. So, like, sniping them isn't... Uh, you know, it, it doesn't hurt me, XP-wise. So, what other eggs do I have to worry about? These ones over here? Alright, what are these guys? Evil Eye, 14 attack. So, they aren't as big of a threat as the other ones, so... Can I actually kill any of these? I can, actually. There we go. They should kill this one. Yeah, so I think I'm doing pretty well this chapter so far. Not too many problems. Almost lost my healer, which actually would have been pretty problematic. Um, I have to be really careful on this map. Like, really careful. Alright, so I killed most of them up here, so let's see what's up here. There is another one I have to deal with. I got all my HP, so I can still move forward. I'm kind of worried on getting this split a bit. Hold on, where's the eggs at? Right there. What's their HP at? Okay, so they're still pretty weak. It's just what I'm worried is I'll send uh, my guy in there, and uh, one of them will hatch, or two of them will hatch. I'll kill one, and then the other two will hatch. So, oh, this is so awkward. Like, these movements, like, what are these movements? <laughs> I don't like it. Yeah, but now all the eggs are starting to hatch, and they can all attack from a distance. I have little choice, do don't I? I kind of just have to hope that they just don't get lucky. Because those are all going to hatch. 
Alright, he's, he's targeting the cell. 55, that's probably gonna hit it. I can't really heal- oh, I missed. Nice. I can't heal you right now because they're gonna snipe my healer off, I can't do anything. What? Wait a second. Why did you burn? Weird. Uh, part of me just wants to get rid of the egg. But I obviously can't. Hmm. This is so weird. I don't like this at all. My odds are horrible. Hold on, what's their what's their distance on that thing? Range three to ten. So it's not like they can hit me from all across the map. If I stick together, they shouldn't be like these guys. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So they can hit like all these guys. That one can. Um So I'm gonna move forward. I'm gonna keep moving forward. I'll send you in. Uh, I'm trying to think how to do this. No, that's not what I want to do. I guess I have to just do it like this. That's fine. 22. Oh, and you can't hit me. That's interesting. Okay. So I got rid of that one. Is the other one gonna um, show up though? I probably should check that one. It wouldn't really change much though. Roll three. Let's see. You are, okay. But regardless, I'm still gonna keep sending my troops forward. Uh, I can't let them split, because that would be horrible. Uh, even though I want to split. I really want to kill that eye. But we need to keep moving forward. We're gonna go straight, and then we're gonna take these guys out, and then we're gonna just charge the boss. Um, yeah, that's... The terrain is, like, super odd. I don't like it. Alright, there we go. And next turn, most of those are gonna hatch. I'm guessing they start to hatch when I'm, like, 10 spaces. And that's way more than 10. I don't know if I have to worry about the ones on in south. I certainly hope not. But those ones in that little, those three, that triad or whatever over there, yeah. It's definitely problematic. Uh, it's starting to move forward too. As long as I keep on my feet, the only way I'll be in trouble is when I get to the ledge, so I can, or I start doing that B line all the way to the boss. But it'll probably take them a long time to actually catch up to me, since I, I can't move that many spaces. But I think I should move enough. Oh god. Oh, I think I know what it is. It's these uh, this red land here. Okay, so, oh, I get it. I get it. All right, let's just kill this guy. I gotta get my people off the red land. You know, the the ones with like the stones. And then it should be good. There we go. But actually, I'm in the episode here, guys. I was gonna do that before I attacked, but I forgot again. Thank you for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the next episode when we go take on the Gorgon boss. I think this is actually one of the first, if not the first boss, that isn't named that we're fighting. But thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Uh, see you later.